What's up guys back to another should you summon video and the next banner on the global version should be Ninja Cecily and Ninja Rin. We know this because of the live stream that CM Ghosty did where it said early October would be these two ninja characters and then the mid October would be PJ Komeko and then the two quote unquote mystery banners. Um, they're also shown in the sneak peek so we pretty much you know double confirmation i guess anyway um these characters aren't anything too special but let's go over them anyway they are not limited meaning you can pull them whenever in the future and on your four star tickets when the banner drops uh cecily is another dark healer um and i know that cecily gets really strong with her secondary um ult for her version two um the version 2 secondary ults aren't out yet on global it's pretty much what they have for their first ult where um for example wiz does water damage and then on her 1.5 she does the slow um eventually units will get that secondary option for their second ult and i know cecily's is really good because it um increases your speed however that's not out right now on global and i just don't see how she would be able to beat Amy as Amy gives gauge. So my assumption is Amy will still be better. So, you know, I wouldn't worry about that too much, uh, but I could be wrong. I'm not, you know, I don't really use Cecily too much. So I could be overlooking something, but personally, I still think Amy will be better for right now. Um, her EX skill is 6% attack when using magic attacks. So I think this is the first Cecily with this, if I'm not mistaken. So that's kind of nice. Uh, she has 113% dark magic damage basic attack. She has a 137 single target dark magic damage and a small party heal. I don't know why the S is over there, um, but I guess it is. So S small, you know. Anyway, a uh, small party heal over time for 5 seconds. Then has a 158 single target magic damage, 211 if above 70% HP, and a tier 2 physical defense debuff for 12 seconds. Um, yeah, it's physical defense debuff. I'm assuming that's because her ults are physical. Uh, the heal over time is nice, but I, you know, her utility is in her ult and healing, and I just don't think that's quite needed at the time. Then we have Rin. Rin is also not limited, thankfully. Uh, it'd be kind of weird if one ninja character was limited and one was not. But anyway, another dark unit. She is the first four star dark Ren, which is cool because we've had a dark ult for Ren for a while now. However, I do think the three star is better. I'm sure you could still find use in the four star, but I think the three star overall is better. Uh, Ninja Ren has a 7% attack when using magic attack EX skill. She has 113 dark magic damage basic, just like the Sicily. She has a 161 single target dark magic damage and tier 2 magic defense debuff for 12 seconds and then a 161 single target dark magic damage 216 if target is debuffed now the reason i think the other one is better is because the other one gives a tier 2 buff to um rin's agility and lowers the enemy's attack i think it's a tier 2 if i'm not mistaken it could be a tier 1 or tier 2 and overall i feel like that you know the speed buff is rather nice. I feel like the magical defense uh, debuff, um, you know, you can apply it with, I believe, Wiz, Aru. Um, Aru should still be pretty used on global, so you can get it from that. Uh, the second skill is rather nice, but I just feel like if you have the Dark Ren and she's free and 555, it's like, why would you summon for a, you know, objectively quote unquote worse character? Um, she probably would do a little bit more damage, but you'd probably get more use out of the three star as it can, you know, increase your survivability and you will get more actions off, meaning more basics, which is huge for mages because they have elemental basics so they can do a lot of damage with red shred up or just, you know, in general. And that's pretty much it. These units aren't anything too crazy, too special. Rin is okay. Um, Cecily will probably see more use in the future, um, but nothing to spend quartz on. So, at the end, should you summon, I would say no. Even, I wouldn't recommend dolphins or, I mean, if you're a whale, you probably are summoning on every banner. But even whales, 
there's really no really reason to summon on this unless you really like Cecilia or really like Rin. Um, yeah, especially with Overlord and Halloween and all these limited banners in the future, there's zero reason to summon on this. Free to play. Save, 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 save. Trust me, there will be banners soon to summon on if you really want to, but just not these guys. But anyway, that's pretty much it for the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more Clone Super content, and I will catch y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching.